Mourinho and Figueroa fight for three times. A trilogy. Now, usually at a trilogy, it stops. But I'm going to preface it by saying, personally for me, I thought Mourinho won this fight. I personally thought Mourinho won this fight. Now, here's where MMA gets really murky. It's, and it's such an interpretive thing. And it was a close fight. That's all I'm going to say. It's a close fight. You know, we can, we can present everything that happened. But no matter how you cut it, it was a very close fight. And Davison Figueroa was able to get away with a unanimous victory, interestingly enough. But it was a close fight. It was a very close fight. And I think in a fight where these guys are clearly, clearly uh, evenly matched, you know, you had throughout the course of it, you know, Davidson with his moments. And, and that's it. The moments that Davidson Figueroa had stood out. The knockdowns that Figueroa had stood out. The kicks, the calf kicks or the kicks where, you know, Davidson was chopping Brandon down stood out. And probably on totality, you were able to, to see how, you know, from a judging criteria, why why people potentially thought that Davison won and maybe he did I don't know like these guys have fought three damn times and I can't quite get a view apart from the second time where Brandon who had an amazing victory and a punctuation there you can clearly see that they're matched very well um Mourinho was very comfortable very comfortable and confident you know in his stand up here the only thing is he was absorbing shots from Davidson he wasn't necessarily addressing the leg kicks. Uh, there was almost a zombie-esque attitude that Brandon had in terms of his striking and that he was willing to take a lot of damage to deal it out. And I think that that is the inherent charm of Brandon Moreno. But again, it's the, there's these lasting little dramatic montages that occurred throughout the time that almost kind of led you to believe that Davison had the upper hand at certain points in time. But they, so what do I think Brandon won? I think on totality, even though there were these big moments, I think that Brandon, you, you know, in scrambly situations was able to get the, the advantage. I think Brandon, while he was copping a lot and, you know, his knockdowns looked more dramatic, he was touching him more. And I think Davidson definitely felt, you know, Brandon's power and was taken aback. It's just the way that kind of translates on screen. Obviously, Davidson Figueroa has the power there. I thought in the totality of it, a lot more of the times Brandon was coming forward and he was providing enough sort of movement and octagon control. And I guess, you know, basically did enough, did enough in my mind to, to secure the victory. But raise it tough, raise it tough. And I don't think I, off the top of my head, actually know of any... Um, you know, past trilogies. What do you call it? Quadrigy? Uh, I don't even know the damn word. <laughs> like, it's really confusing. And I feel like, you know, while there's legs to do it, there's potentially, I think we need a bit of a break from these guys, man. Like, uh, the, the lead up will be good if Mourinho can go in, win another fight, you know, and just, just come straight back in. But I just feel like we need a little bit of a break, even though, you know, it was an exciting fight. Was it as exciting as the first fight? Hell no. Was it as conclusive as the second fight? Hell no, obviously. Um, so yeah, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a bit in, in between with that. All I do know is Mourinho is a fan favorite and his attitude is absolutely the best. Davidson is an interesting cat. Um, and, you know, there's a little bit of drama in the whole division now that you have these guys, you know, at the one and the two, uh, and I think Kai Kara France, and oh, I'm just, I've just lost the name of the guy that he's going to fight for. Should should have a shot at that, but uh, interesting fight, interesting fight, and you know, the first main card of the year. Check out our Inganu and Cyril Gun reaction as well. Um, you know, leave some comments. What did you think? Who did you think win the won the fight? Why? And you know, we hope to see you. Uh, soon in the channel again.